Hi, my name is Fatima. And my name is Rashawn. And this is Right Here, Right Now News. Now for today's story, a famous rapper has stopped making music due to cyberbullying. And in Southeast Asia, they have created high-tech computer AI to help people. But today's main story is that there was a petition with over 100,000 signatures signed to let 16-year-olds get the vote. Now over to Curtis at the House of Parliament. Hi guys, I'm here outside the House of Parliament, where we witnessed the MP say his thoughts on lowering the voting age. Here's what he said. Due to multiple online petitions and endorsements from high-profile figures in both the public and the private sectors, we have decided to hold a public referendum on whether 16-year-olds should be given the vote. So that was the MP's opinion. Now to Tina at Chestnut Grove Academy. Hey guys, I'm your correspondent Tina Matthews and I'm here on scene at Chestnut Grove Academy to ask students and teachers if they think 16-year-olds should be allowed to vote. Let's go. I think they should be allowed to vote because it's going to affect them in the future and it will be their decisions on what they will do. Yep, if you're old enough to have sex and die for your country, you should be able to vote. So I'm here with the teen rights leader, Saul Bream. What are you doing to help the youth get into politics? Well, we're currently putting uh, young adults into positions of power in our youth centres. So do you think schools should educate the younger years into getting into politics? Yes, I definitely agree that uh, schools should be teaching young people like what it is to vote and how to vote. If young people are taught from a young age that their voice does matter, this is how you can make changes. Wow, that was really interesting. Hold on a second, we're getting some breaking news. Curtis has managed to get some public opinions at the House of Parliament. Let's see what they have to say. The minimum age should be around 18 to 20 years, so by that time they get the proper knowledge of what the, how the Constitution is running and who are the right candidates to vote for. I think it's not a good idea because they are not enough mature. This is a really complex issue. Personally, I'm undecided. What do you guys think in the studio? Yeah, I agree because as a 16 year old myself, the vote really affects me. What about you, Rashawn? I agree with that, but I feel like the government should put enforce more learning into politics in schools. That's very true, but we want to know what you guys think, so contact us on Instagram, Snapchat and Facebook.